Hi, I'm Tati. Let's tier rank some more books. So, we're back with more tier ranking. Um, Casey West is, I would say, a popular young adult author. She writes mostly contemporary romance young adult fiction, I think, that I know of. Um, I am a fan of her books. I've read most of them. And tier ranking Casey West books was actually a suggestion in the comments. So thank you so much for suggesting this. I love Casey West books and it's going to be super fun to tier rank them. And again, these are in no particular order. And we're starting with By Your Side by Casey West, which is right over there. By Your Side is really good. It's just, it's so much fun. It's such a good one. I'm going to put it in best because literally she got trapped in a library. Next is Fame, Fate, and the First Kiss. Now, I believe I read this one not too long ago. This is either like the last one I read or the second to last one I read. And I really enjoyed this one because it had a tiny bit of a mystery element to it along with the um, romance element. So I'm going to put it in great. And then we have Lucky in Love, which I have not read yet. I just haven't gotten to it. Um, Love, Life, and the List. I did enjoy this one. I think I'm going to put it in good. I mean, I really liked it when I read it. Listen to Your Heart. I think I'm going to put this one in good as well. Moment of Truth, I have not read. I think it's the newest one that just came out. It didn't just come out because I think it came out maybe in March. Um, but it's the newest one that I know of. Um, maybe This Time was the last one I read. I'm sure I talked about it in a wrap-up recently. Um, I'm going to put it in great. I liked that one a lot. On the Fence. This is, I think, best friends to lovers trope, plus she's a tomboy, so that trope is thrown in there as well. Um, I do remember really liking this one, so I think I'm going to put it in great. This was one of her earlier ones. Next up is Pivot Point. I have not read Pivot Point or Split Second, which is the second book in that series. These ones are the only ones I think that are not contemporary romance. I, I think they're either sci-fi or dystopian, I'm not sure, but I haven't read them. P.S. I Like You. I, I remember, I feel like I was surprised by how much I liked it when I did read it. I'm gonna put it in great. I don't know how I'm rating this, my scale is all over the place. Next is The Distance Between Us, which is another one of my favorite favorite ones. Like, I gave P.S. I Like You four stars, and I gave The Distance Between Us three stars. But The Distance Between Us, I feel like I have to put it in best, because I think it was the first Casey West book I ever read. Just when I look at the cover, I have fond memories of it. So I'm gonna put it in best. I feel like I need to reread all of these. <laughs> and then the fill-in boyfriend the last one here, I do remember reading this one, and I'm going to put it in okay. I did like reading it. See, the thing is, all of these are great stories, but when I'm trying to compare them to each other in order to rank them, it, it, got, it gets really mixed up. Not at all what I was expecting this to look like. But the reason The Fill-In Boyfriend is going in okay is just because the main character annoyed me quite a bit for most of the book and she's supposed to be written that way. So even though this is a three star book, which is the same as I gave The Distance Between Us, it's just when you're tear ranking them against each other something weird happens. <laughs> um, so that one is going in okay. And that is my tier list for Casey West's books. It really is not at all what I was expecting it to look like. And I think if I were to like do just like a marathon read of all of her books and then tier rank them again, it would look completely different. But anyway, that is my tier list. In best, we have By Your Side and The Distance Between Us. 
In great, we have Fame, Fate, and the First Kiss, Maybe This Time, On the Fence, and P.S. I Like You. In good, we have Love, Life, and the List, and Listen to Your Heart. In okay, we have The Fill-In Boyfriend. In worst, we have Nothing, um, which is a first. In have not read, we have Lucky in Love, Moment of Truth, Pivot Point, and Split Second. Um, I do have those books on my TBR, I believe. The, all the ones in the have not read. So let me know in the comments which one I should pick up first. Also let me know in the comments what else you would like to see me tier rank. I have new videos every Tuesday and Friday, so subscribe if you like to see more. If you like this video, please give it a like. Thanks for watching! Bye! Da -da -da. Why does it look sideways? Also, <laughs> full disclosure, my sister is a bigger Casey West fan than I am, and these are all her books that I borrowed for this video. Is there anything else I need to say? <laughs> Alright, hopefully something from that will do, and I have to edit and upload this by tomorrow, so let's get to it. And that's it.